between Q and the Q posts or the Q drops and Q anon and Q anon community. Jacob, I don't know what any of these things are. Okay, so let's break this down. Q is a psychological operation. Okay. Now, psychological operations are largely based on three factors. Number one is neuro linguistic programming. That is the use of certain uh, words, linguistics, to program neurons or the pattern of neurons in the brain, in, in particular the subconscious portion of the brain, to affect the way that a person consciously perceives reality. Okay. Okay. Number two, you have something called critical factor bypass. Critical factor bypass is where you saturate the entirety of the environment in the media, newspapers, magazines, television shows, in the corporate world, in banking, you name it, in schools, colleges. You saturate all of them with a very specific message and you repeat it over and over and over and over again. Okay? Now, what happens then is that the subconscious mind, because it sees it everywhere, it assumes that it must be true, that this has to be real because it's everywhere in the environment. Yeah. So it programs, once again, the subconscious mind to affect the way the conscious mind perceives reality. Now, based on neurolinguistically programming the individual and mass neurolinguistically programming the populations through critical factor bypass, why they call it that is because your critical thinking is bypassed because it's programmed the subconscious brain. That creates something called mass formation hypnosis, okay? Where 25 to 30% of the population believes this external stimuli, believes and is programmed by this material. They're just sheep, sheeple. Sheeple, okay. okay? So in order for mass formation hypnosis to occur, that 25 to 35, uh, 25 to 30% of the population has to gain some sort of heightened level of radicalism where they scream the loudest and then they get a hold of the levers of power, right? Now, when it comes down to stopping this process from happening, all you need is 5% or more of the population to not become hypnotized and say, no, this is ludicrous. You are nuts. We are not doing that. Now, we've seen the effects of mass formation hypnosis, critical factor bypass, and neuro-linguistic programming in Nazi Germany. We saw it with the Bolshevik Revolution in Russia and the USSR. We saw it in the Red Revolution in China and the Chinese Communist Party, okay? So we've seen the effects of this process, and it is psychological warfare, okay? Now, when it comes to Q and the Q operation, and the reason I say it's a psychological operation is this. This is how it differs. The Operation Mockingbird Media, what I call the Mockingbird Media, Operation Mockingbird, CIA, infiltrating the media outlets, yep. right? So the Mockingbird Media uses the techniques I just laid out to program the populations so that they can use this propaganda to go to war. And then they can transfer public money into private hands. You see? So it's a, it's, it's a whole scheme. It's all about maintaining the status quo. Now, Q, Q is on the internet. It first started on 4chan, then on 8 Kun. And when I was looking at it from an ob uh, objective perspective, what I saw was that 